It's a deeper one here. Right next to the asphalt. Hmm, this is gonna be, is it a spring? I don't think it's a spring red. Oh, it's asphalt down there, dude. This is nasty soil here. Uh, right there. Oh, it's deep, man. It doesn't sound very good. I think it's under the asphalt. Right on top of the asphalt. This is a good thing. Come on, baby, come on, come on. Oh. Oh, you got to be kidding me. Right there. It's a penny underneath the asphalt right there. Look at that. Penny underneath the asphalt. That's crazy, man. It was, I think it was on its edge. See? Asphalt's right there and asphalt's right there. There's a little hole in there, right? It's in that little crook right there. I think it was on this edge. That is freaking amazing. 14 kilohertz stock hot program. That is crazy. Actually, I have my recovery speed at 2.5 instead of 3. That's crazy, man. What the heck is that? The pencil racer cover. Some junk. Super wet here, saturated. That's the sprinkler head. All right. Okay, I think I'm gonna call it quits for today. Cause the soil here is just too bad. That's some junk. Here. This one sounds junky, like a nail. Oh, it's hard here. Compacted clay. Oh, it's gravel. Right there, clay. Oh, really bad clay. Black clay down there, too. Be up here. Right there. Oh, it's compacted big time, man. Right there. It's a pencil razor. Right there. Okay. Got like that. Slop it right back in there. There, man. Little pencil racer. Oh, that one seems junky. All right. I'm still gonna go for it. It's a pencil racer. Oh, it's, it's uh, gravelly here too. Right there. Yeah, it's pretty shallow here. Gravel. Come on, baby. Get some juice over here. It's another pencil racer right there. I'm sure it goes in there, right? bottle cap or some iron here. Something round. A little washer or something. Some junk here. A bottle cap. Oh, it's gummy here, man. Oh, dude, I see something right there. No, it's, it's gotta be some iron. Some big iron. A bottle cap or something. Large chunk of iron. Come on, baby, come on. Some foil popping out. Oh, boy. Hmm. in the side wall right there. Come on, baby. Some, some iron right there. Some iron. I think there's another target right next to it, too. Just go off. My hands are all slimy. So it's 
hard, really hard for me to push my pinpointer, turn my pinpointer on and off. I hear. I'm gonna skip that one. It sounds a little bit too irony for me. My grab out a little bit off here. It's not too bad though. So I'm gonna fill up the garbage can here. And take off for take off for a little while. Come back later on. Bunch of junk. All right. Come back later on. I'm gonna walk home. Take off. Come back when this snow is melted. All right. It's too hard to, to detect with all this wet snow on the surface. It's just so nasty. And it's really saturated. So I might come back here in a couple days. I don't think I'm really gonna get in too much detecting tomorrow because um, the ground is gonna be too saturated everywhere. Everywhere I go. I'm gonna have problems. Except if I, if I can hit a couple top lots, I might be able to hit a couple top lots tomorrow. So I'll plan ahead and plan to do a couple top lots tomorrow because it's just gonna be, and there's another pot can right there. I don't wanna take the pot can home with me. I'll come get it later on when I'm going back the other way towards the garbage can. They just replaced this fence here. They just replaced this fence here this last year. Actually, up there, they didn't replace this fence right here, but right up to that second tree there, they replaced all that fence and they took it out. And I freaking went went there just the same day that they took that fence out. I was watching them. I was over on the other side of the park and I was watching them, made sure made sure that they were going home. And then they went home and I detected right where they pulled all the posts out and this is an old school, right? I found four wheat pennies and three dimes. Not silver dimes, but just clad dimes. Right where the posts are, right where the fence was at, right? Because you can't detect that when the fence is there, right? You can't detect this spot right here. You're, you're gonna be, it's gonna be tough to get targets right here, right? You know? But once they take that fence out there, it's game on, man. So I'm always watching for them taking fences out, man. Big time. Especially at the schools, right? You got to get in there the same day as they get those fences out and just hunt it. You know, it's not very much area. You know, I've, I've hunted out there. I've hunted out here. I've hunted out here for many, many hours, but I've never been able to, I don't know what's directly underneath that fence right there. There could be some awesome stuff there. This is Silver Street, right? Right here. This street right here is Silver Street. So I found dozens of silvers on this street. I think uh, 19 silvers just in this block right here. This block in front of three houses, I found 17 silvers and then a couple right here, All right? Well, thank you for watching. Please subscribe.